Hi, I'm Magnolia Blossom, and I'm here with a new adventure story. So let's just get right to it. Roll with that thing, Grandma said, not to worry, not to worry. Well, they did worry. She worried a lot about that Hummer. She goes, Grandma, Grandma, they're going to get in that Hummer. They'll catch up with us. They'll, they're going to run us off the road. While Grandma was going just as fast as she could down that mountain road. Now, it seemed really fast, but Grandma really wasn't driving all that fast. It was still a safe drive. She says, Honey, don't worry about it. Those people are not going to follow us in that Hummer. How, how do you know? Faith was watching Grandma's eyes in the rearview mirror. And her eyes told her, Trust me, they are not going to be able to follow in that Hummer. I suspected that they were up to no good, so their tires are flat. Now Cheyenne jumps in and says, But Grandma, I read that Hummers have self-healing tires that when they get punctured, they freeze up somehow and fill up the hole and you can still drive on them. Grandma was really happy to hear that Cheyenne had done a little research on something such as a Hummer. And she says, Honey, that is really good research, but that's the kind of Hummers that the military drive. This is just an H3. They're not, they do not have self-healing tires. It's, this is for civilian use. They will not self-heal. I can guarantee you with three punctured tire, even if they try to drive on it, they're not going to follow us for long. And Cheyenne seems like she's really excited about it and is talking to Grandma in the front seat and is all animated. And Faith is kind of mad. She's getting really mad because, one, she's only 11, which means she cannot sit in the front seat because she's not old enough or tall enough for the airbag yet. So she's sitting back there behind Faith or behind Cheyenne. And she just thumps with her foot the back of Cheyenne's seat, just for good measure, just for good measure. That was for being 14 and being able to sit in the front seat. Then as they were driving along, she got to thinking about, she had that Garmin. What'd she got a Garmin for? And she didn't tell me anything about it. She thumped that back seat again. Grandma and her looked like they were having a good time talking about something, but she couldn't quite hear them. She couldn't quite hear them. So she thumped that seat twice more. And then, and then she remembered about the password. You know, Grandma and her have a password. That's a secret. She can be trusted with a secret. Why didn't she know the password? Thump, thump, thump on the back of Cheyenne's seat. Boy, Faith was sitting in the back seat just a fuming, just a fuming. And then, and then she thought about Cheyenne getting to go off to the room by themselves and pack a few things. And she got to decide which things came along and which things didn't. You know, maybe she didn't take, bring along that favorite book that she was reading. So she was mad some more. She thump, thump, thump. And then, and then, to top it all off, Grandma reaches over and takes a hold of Cheyenne's knee and gives it a squeeze. And they kind of look and laugh at each other. Now, what are they laughing about? Faith goes, we got people chasing us, probably, sometime, and they're sitting up in the front seat laughing, and I'm sitting here in the back seat, and I don't know anything about anything that's going on. Thump, thump, thump. Well, that was about as much as Cheyenne wanted to take. So she turned around and says to Faith, Faith, stop stomping on my, the back of my seat. And Faith says to her, I will when I want to, and I don't want to now. Thump, thump, thump. What is wrong with you? Cheyenne asked. I am mad. You guys are sitting in the front seat laughing and giggling and people are chasing us. And then, and then you got a Garmin. I didn't know about that. You got a, you got no password. You got to have the keys. You seem to have some kind of secret. And as she was listing off her complaints, a phone rang. And Cheyenne took a phone out of her pocket, a mobile phone. And Faith goes, and where did you get that mobile phone? 
You don't have a mobile phone. Mom and Daddy said we couldn't have a phone until we were 15. 15. I don't think you guys are very nice. So, and you've got secrets too. Thump, 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 thump. All the time, Grandma was just sort of listening to this and kind of snickering to herself, thinking, yeah, that Faith, she's a spunky little girl when she gets going. Well, the phone rings, and Cheyenne whispers something to Grandma. Thump, thump, thump! You know, Cheyenne turns around and says, you know, Faith, you want to know something? I'll tell you something, something that I don't think you know. You want to know something? And Faith goes, yeah, I want to know something. Tell me something. So Cheyenne turned around and she says, well, I'll tell you something. Grandma is a spy. <laughs>